Hello and welcome to ASB Now. I'm Megan Makatangay. And I'm Cassie Madrigal. ASB Now is our new show where we show you what ASB is doing around our school and for our school. ASB stands for Associated Student Body. We plan all the fun things around the school like spirit days, dances, and special events, as well as help organize the school's clubs and sports. ASB runs like an actual business. Our business meetings are on Tuesdays and Thursdays where we plan what to do with money for certain organizations and clarify the details for events that are going on around the school. Let's see inside of one of those meetings and send it out to our phenomenal field crew, Josh Coyle and photojournalist, Will Baptist. All right, so we just watched the ASB business meeting on this Thursday, January 12th. Uh, we saw a lot of motions passed, a lot of motions second. They're not doing a lot of things today. They're just working on posters and not doing a whole lot. We'll probably get a lot of interviews in the next following days as we come visiting this class more. But as of right now, uh, they told us today was not the best day to film, yet we film anyways. The film must go on. All right, so as I said before, we are in the ASB meeting, and we just saw them making posters. This is a girls' water polo poster. Uh, what is your name, ma'am? Uh, Cassie. Cassie, what a beautiful name. So you're cutting out this poster right now. How often do you work on posters for ASB? Um, for me, not as much. I'm more so doing secretary work, but over on the class, we do a oh, lot, like every day. <laughs> Lots of posters every day. That's great because I see posters around the school so much and the posters are so exciting. When I was in water polo, I got lots of posters and I love them. They're in my room right now. So thank you for that. Of course. That's awesome. How do I have treats? Thank you, Josh and Will. Those meetings are very helpful to us so we can organize ASB and learn about how our sports and clubs are growing. January 17th through the 20th, we had another spirit week where students could pick one way or the other to dress up, like athlete versus mathy. Do you get it? Anyways, uh, basically we had this spirit week just because we wanted to and in order to advertise our upcoming winter rally, which was postponed because of the rain. You know. Due to having no school on Monday, we started on Tuesday. So Tuesday was superhero versus villains, Wednesday was country versus country club, and finally on Thursday we had athlete versus mathlete, which I'm not, not your a mathlete. I'm not a mathlete, man. But isn't that your favorite? Uh, yeah, sure. Let's be for real. Anyways. Now let's toss it out to the handsome men known as Josh and Will to see how students dress up for Versus Spirit Week. Alright, so we are filming our Versus Spirit Week and today is Superheroes versus Supervillains. I'm here with Benji and he is clearly dressed as a superhero Spider-Man aka Peter Parker. So what made you choose to be a superhero today instead of a supervillain? Bro, I'm Spider-Man bro. Who wants to go against the amazing Spider-Man like me, dude? I'm up the best fit it out here, bro. So he... So he didn't answer the question. All right, now on the other side of this versus Spirit Week, we do have the supervillains, and as you can see, boo how we have the Joker. So what made you choose to be a supervillain opposed to a superhero? I mean, it's the only shot I had. I didn't really have anything else being a superhero. Okay. It, you, yeah, you just got to be Joker, kind of crazy, kind of yeah. kind of crazy. Yeah. He gets pretty crazy, dude. Yeah, he does. He does. All right, so it is Wednesday, January 18th, and now it is Country versus Country Club. As you can see, I am dressed as Country Club, and Eddie here is dressed as Country. So what made you choose Country over Country Club? Well, it's because, you know, since I'm a Mexican-American, I decided, you know, why not dress up as a vaquero, also known as, you know, a cowboy in Spanish. <laughs> See. Yeah. Now I have my country club brother in with me. We are all dressed up as country club attire. You guys look sick. Thank you. Thank you so much. You do too. Oh, wow. <laughs> Stop. All right. So on my left here, I have Borge. And on my right here, I have Jaden. And we all dressed in country club attire. Why did you choose country club over country? Uh, I have more country club attire. Mm. That's great. Um, well, um, I was kind of lazy. And I was like, oh, you know what? I had this. And, you know, I love money. So... You love money? Of course. The Bible says the love of money is the root of all evil. I see. So do you frequently attend country clubs? Yeah, I'm on the golf team. Ooh, you? Um, I don't know, my mom was poor when she was little, so I don't know for sure. So, wait, you don't know for sure if you attend country clubs? Oh, oh, that was a question. <laughs> um, I would like to. I heard, I wonder if the food's good. I wonder if they have rice. They, I, uh, uh, not often, Jaden says to Borge about the rice. It is now Thursday the 19th and it is Mathlete versus Athlete. I'm dressed as an athlete and these two lovely ladies are dressed as Mathletes. What is your name? Nicole. Alexa. Nicole and Alexa. So, do you enjoy math? Today I do. Today she does. 
Sometimes. Sometimes. Enough, you could say, to dress as a mathlete. Now, what constitutes a mathlete? I'm assuming you've been to lots of tournaments. Uh, yeah, actually. Uh, I've actually like a champion. Math champion. champion, math champion. Um, I forgot the question. <laughs> she forgot the question. All right, on the other side of the Spirit Day, we have the athletes, and this is my athlete dress brother, and we're both dressed as athletes, Brayden. So, you are an athlete, correct? Yes. What do you play? Uh, track and field right now. Play track and field right now, that's great. And as you can see, he's injured. He has a whole boot on his foot, so what was that injury from? It was what? What was that injury from? Oh, I just sprained it really bad. I just sprained it really bad. At track? At it as an athlete? No, I was actually training for track, and uh, I haven't been able to do it since. So. Yeah. That's tough. Well, hopefully you can get that boot off soon, because that is just such a bummer. Yeah, maybe he'll be able to get the boot off someday. <laughs> someday, someday. That was fantastic. Looks like a lot of people dressed up to show their spirit. At the end of the spirit week, there was going to be a winter pep rally, but like we said, it was postponed due to the weather. Well, our show is winding down, but we have a surprise for you before we go. ASB's biggest event, prom, is all everyone keeps talking about, and everyone's wondering, where will it be? Well, we have an exclusive preview of the, where this year's prom will be. Once again, here's the classy men, Josh and Will, to reveal the big secret. I'm also there. Thank you guys so much. I think that I am a classy man. And we're on our way up to prom right now to see the venue. I have a blindfold on. I cannot see anything. Maybe the camera's over here. Maybe it's over here. Maybe it's down here. I have no idea. But it's going to be a surprise to me to see it. Just like it's going to be a surprise to all of you guys. As soon as we see this venue, they're going to rip my blindfold off. and be like, what? This is what it looks like. Because I have no idea what it's going to look like. And I'm super excited. Gosh, this is so cool! Look at this! What? So this is the prom venue and it is so beautiful. We have so much plant wildlife here that makes it look gorgeous. We have so many great spots to take pictures. The dance floor is awesome. There's bathrooms and it's just gonna be a super fun time. Let me show you all around. So this is one of those photo spots I was talking about right by this fountain. There's gonna be water shooting out. Pew, pew, pew. It's gonna look like such a crazy fountain. You're gonna take lots of selfies with your friends right here. It's gonna be so great for this spot. So this is another great spot to take pictures at. There's lots of plants around me. There's that gazebo thing back there that you can take at. And I think it's just gonna be great to take pictures here and walk through and it's really pretty. <sighs> So this right here is gonna be a hangout area where you can talk with your friends and hang out. There's gonna be tables, lawn games back there. There's gonna be music and you can dance here, but the main dancing area is gonna be over here. So this right here is gonna be the main dancing area. It's gonna get lit right here. There's gonna be lots of raving and crazy dancing. And on the walkway up here, there's actually this crazy plant garden, wall of plants garden. And this is really cool. This is gonna be another great picture spot. Maybe a little lovely couple walk, hold hands with the person you love. It's going to be so cute and so fun. This right here is going to be where the DJ is. He's going to be spinning music and making it crazy for all of you guys to dance. And I am just so excited for this prom. So this is the prom venue for this 2023 prom, and it is going to be so fantastic. I'm so excited. Prom is going to be April 22nd from 6 to 10 p.m., and ticket sales start February 6th. Can't wait. That's so cool. I know prom is going to be incredible. As it gets closer, we'll keep you updated with the latest prom information. Thank you so much for joining us. For Josh and Will, I'm Cassie Madrigal. And I'm Megan Makatangai. We'll see you next time on ASB Now. Bye! Bye.